What's up, guys, and welcome to my review for the new thriller drama horror. I wouldn't really call it a horror, but I would call it a thriller drama heretic. Heretic? I don't know how to pronounce this movie, but you want to know what? It stars Hugh Grant, Chloe East, and Sophie Thatcher. This is a tiny cast. You have Chloe East and Sophie Thatcher coming in as these two girls who are going around trying to talk about the Bible, talk about all that sort of thing. You get the knock on the door. Hey, do you want to hear about our Lord and Savior? You know, that sort of thing. They knock on Hugh Grant's door because he's shown interest in the church. He lets them in, and throughout the film, he tests them on their beliefs. The first thing I'll say about this movie is if you are very heavy into a certain religion and you go to see this movie as a casual movie fan, it might anger you because the way Hugh Grant talks in this movie, you probably try to avoid these type of people in your life. So as he's sort of talking about certain philosophies and you know what could be true and what might not be true, you might be like, okay, not for me. I don't like the subject matter of this film. But by the end of it, I would say the last 20 minutes, you know, it, it kind of, I wouldn't necessarily say fell flat for me, but it didn't leave me off on a high note. I think that the movie is not as clever as it really thinks it is. It introduces a lot of ideas, but by the end of the film and things start to wrap up and you start to really discover what Hugh Grant's character is actually doing and what he believes in and what he's accomplishing, you're like, okay, they had to go somewhere with the story. And I think that the the way that it sets up the mystery and when it does ask questions, the first like hour of this film, I think is the strongest. But when it starts to have to go towards the finale and answer a lot of these questions that were asked, I wasn't too ecstatic about the the answers or the resolutions in this movie. So I think that the performances are absolutely fantastic. Hugh Grant is too good for this movie. I'm not too sure why he took this role, probably because he just wanted to have fun with it. He's got a lot of monologues in this movie, and he's excellent in this. And the two girls, Chloe East and Margaret Thatcher, are fantastic in this as well. But by the time it ends, you're just kind of like, Oh, okay. You know, that was good. I like the 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 questions that arose from the film, but then it sort of starts to answer them by the end of it. Like I said, I think that's my my biggest issue is it just kind of didn't end as strongly uh, as maybe I would have hoped because I think the setup was great. It was just the payoff that wasn't as satisfying as maybe the, the rest of the movie was. So it left me kind of wanting more, but I didn't dislike it. I liked it. And in the end of the day, I'm going to give Heretic three and a half out of five stars. Would I recommend it? Yeah, if you want to see a film with great performances that asks a lot of interesting questions, definitely go ahead and see it. But when you start to get answers to those questions, the movie might leave you sort of dissatisfied or underwhelmed. So that's my thoughts on Heretic, guys. Comment down below. Do you plan on seeing this movie? What's your thoughts on it if you do? Also, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. We got a bunch of reviews coming in the future, including a review for Blitz, which I'm going to be posting back to back with this. So you could check that out. Also, we've got some other big reviews coming for Enora, A Good Life, A Real Life, A Real Person, The Jesse Eisenberg, A Real Pain. That's the one. And also, we've got Gladiator 2 and Wicked right around the corner. I'm very excited, particularly for Gladiator 2. So guys, don't forget to follow me on Twitter and or X at RyanKing72 and Instagram and TikTok at KingArises131. That's been it for me. Thank you so much for watching my review for Heretic. And until next time, over and out.